Hey guys, welcome to the adding and deleting tutorial for Blender. In this video, we're going to go over how to add primitives and delete objects. So pretty simple stuff. When I say add a primitive, basically I mean cubes, spheres, toruses, cones, etc, etc. So, so we're going to go ahead and start with deleting first because that's a more universal function. So I'm going to go ahead and select this cube here and I'm going to hit X for delete. And that will bring up a menu here. It doesn't delete it automatically. It brings up a menu for confirmation. And so you can either left click to confirm, press enter or press D to confirm. So there's several different options there. Now, quite simply, you can just hit delete as well and then enter. That's what I typically do or X left click. Those are probably the fastest ways to do it. This applies to all forms of deletion. So just remember X or delete will work. Now, how do you add an object? Well, adding objects is pretty simple as well. There's a hotkey for that. And the hotkey is shift A. And you get this beautiful menu of what type of primitives you want to add. So the most basic one is meshes, of course. You can add a plane. And it will add it wherever your 3D cursor is. So you might be wondering, this 3D cursor, what is it for? You've been probably noticing every time you left click, it's sort of moving around with no real purpose, doesn't really do anything, you can't do anything else with it, you can't select it. But it moves whenever you left click somewhere. Well, that's what it's for. It's sort of the spawn point for any new objects, amongst other things. You can also add a cube. You can also add, let me just move this cursor here and add a uh, sphere. And uh, you can do all these things just through this menu right here. And of course, you can move it even as well. Now, there's another way you can do it in case you don't want to use hotkeys. You can go ahead and press T or press this uh, plus button here. You can do that or you can press T, either one. And you'll notice you can go to this create tab here and you have the basically the same menu. So you can actually add whatever you want. So I'm going to take this moment also to show you that you can add lamps and text, armature, lattice, empties, speakers and cameras. Lamps are for lighting. Curves are basically a mathematical uh, representation of a line or curve instead of a polygon representation. Obviously, meshes are all polygons, so you actually have vertices and stuff like that making up this mesh. So again, you can go here, you can select cylinder, you can select monkey, right? Monkey is otherwise known as Suzanne and is Blender's mascot. And uh, yeah, you can do the same thing here. There's lamp options here, camera, empty, armature, these two menus do basically the same thing. So that's how you add and delete objects. 